For the game between Magnus Carlsen and Anish Giri, the first move was played by Elisabetta Polichoniade, the Romanian chess legend who turned 80 today. It was the start of the sixth round of the Shamkir chess tournament. Giri, who was still sitting on a small plus score against the world champion, decided to play solid, and so did Carlsen. As a result, the position was completely equal around move 20, and the game was over after about an hour or so. Uh, yeah, I think uh, I think Anish really likes his plus score against me, <laughs> so uh, he's uh, he's entitled to that. So he never put himself at risk. No, it's a very safe line uh, for white. I mean, black is always aiming to equalize there, so I think it's normal. Uh, basically, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, if he plays a solid opening uh, and I either have to uh, have to try to go all out or I uh, play for a small plus and uh, of course if, if he defends well, uh, you're not going to get, get much with a small plus. Carlsen was asked what he did on the rest day. Uh, we, um, there was a football tournament uh, and that was fun, uh, although it was maybe less dramatic than last year. <laughs> One of the journalists asked Carlsen what he would do if Real Madrid asked him to play football for them. If I was given such an offer as a football player, I would <coughs> ask them to examine their brains. The game between Wesley So and Shakhyar Mamadiarov was highly theoretical and ended in a draw as well. Somehow the Azerbaijani grandmaster wasn't top fit and at the press conference he revealed why. Yeah, we, we played yesterday t till the morning village. Uh, I forget to re <laughs> the patient for the game. <laughs> and okay, I just play. You just play chess? Yeah, yeah I just play chess, yeah. Uh -huh. Outside, uh, no time for uh, preparation. <laughs> we played uh, till f 4 o'clock village. <laughs> Here we see a brief clip of last night. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Adams was better throughout this game with Maxime Fagé Le Graf and even won a pawn, but it wasn't enough. Some stages I was making a bit of progress, but you know, at some stage around the uh, time control, we seem to just come to a bit of an impasse, and I don't know. It seems to be impossible to keep uh, any major pieces on in a sensible way. Vichy Anand played the Karo Khan against Ralph Mamedov, but failed to really surprise his opponent. Mamedov played solid, and also here the point was split. Well, it's nice to be a little bit unpredictable, but it didn't really work out in terms of what I wanted to get. The game of the day was Vladimir Kramnik versus Fabiano Caruana. The Russian GM, who lost to Mamelyarov before the rest day, seemed to be bouncing back when, around move 23, his position was quite promising. From that moment it went downhill. I felt my position was very unpleasant. Uh, I didn't, I mean, I have no ideas, I can't really do anything. Yeah, I mean, today I was a bit lucky because I, I normally, I mean, I, if Vladimir was in his best form, I think he would have tortured me from this position for a long time. Um, but yeah, maybe maybe in my previous game against Anish, I was a, a little bit unlucky, so. Three rounds to go. Will Magnus win this one, or is there still a chance for So or even Anand? Like our video, and then let us know in the comments what you think. The most thoughtful comment will get a month of Diamond membership on chess.com.